during the pandemic, there is another virus looming. Thanks for joining us live on TV, Roku, or wherever you're streaming us tonight. I'm Jackie Kostek. New data reveals COVID-19 cases will climb as we approach the end of the year. 13 Action News reporter Austin Carter is at the Southern Nevada Health District with what this all means. Well, a Valley doctor says it could be cause for concern. She called it a twindemic as COVID-19 and the flu will both be in play. Health experts have their eyes on a possible surge of coronavirus cases in the U.S. to come in the fall and winter months. People want to go to movies. They want to go and eat. And, and the, the fatigue has set in because we notice numbers go down in the summer. And people are like, I don't want to stop living. I want to enjoy myself. Dr. Dahlia Wax says a buildup of quarantines and isolation is driving more people to be out and about which may cause trouble soon. We're going to have the COVID and the flu, and there might be a chance that you could get infected with both. These models from the University of Washington's Institute for Health Metrics and Evaluation aren't looking good. Their prediction, a surge in cases beginning next month and climbing through the end of the year. Their prediction on daily deaths, 3,000 by December's end. We're kind of mixed on whether it's going to be as dangerous and as ICU troubling this next month versus it's just, you know, more people are having cases. A big fall event, Halloween. The CDC has already issued some guidance on that, classifying trick-or-treating as a high-risk activity amid the pandemic. Governor Sisolak will be adjusting capacity limits for large gatherings next week. We're also expecting to see some changes when it comes to youth sports restrictions. We'll stay on top of this story. I'm Austin Carter, 13 Action News.